There are many different compounds in, in cannabis. Two, two of the most common ones are THC, tetrahydrocannabidiol, which is, a, um, which is a, the stuff that's psychoactive, it makes somebody uh, develop a high. And then CBD cannabidiol is, uh, there's, there's receptors throughout the body for this particular substance. There's CBD1 receptors, CBD2 receptors. These are the two most common ingredients in, in cannabis. CBD, there's been shown for some time now, decades, that it can have a medicinal effect. CBD is the more medicinal part of, of, of these compounds. One chemical in marijuana, THC, is responsible for the psychoactive effects, or the high. It also combats nausea and pain. But another chemical, called CBD, seems to have additional benefits. In San Francisco, these researchers say that compound CBD can kill cancer cells and stop them from metastasizing in human cells and mice. This compound that appears to be quite effective at inhibiting cancer. A lot of the medical benefits of cannabis that are attributed to THC or other cannabinoids are actually due to the CBD content of the cannabis. It has very strong anti-inflammatory properties. And not only does it help suppress inflammation, but there was a study that showed that it also helps the body to not make the chemical that causes inflammation. So it actually has somewhat of a preventive role. Cannabidiol has also been found to have anti-convulsant properties in that it can reduce the seizure threshold for a number of patients. I've had my own patients who have said that once they started using CBD rich strains, they have found that they have had less um, episodes of their uh, seizures.